Hi and welcome to the session. Let us discuss the following question which says let A be the matrix of order 3 by 3 with the elements 3, 2, 5, 4, 1, 3, 0, 6, 7. Express A as sum of two matrices such that one is symmetric and the other is skew symmetric. Now before moving on to the solution, let's recall what is a symmetric and skew symmetric matrix. Any square matrix A is said to be symmetric if A transpose is equal to A and any square matrix A is said to be skew symmetric if A transpose is equal to minus A. Now, let us also recall an important theorem which will be very helpful for this question. That is, for any square matrix A, with real number entries A plus A transpose is a symmetric matrix and A minus A transpose is a skew symmetric matrix This is the key idea for this question. Now let's see its solution. We are given a matrix A of order 3 by 3 with elements 3, 2, 5, 4, 1, 3, 0, 6, 7. So first of all, we will find out A transpose. Now, transpose of a matrix is obtained by interchanging the rows and columns of that matrix. So here, A transpose will be a matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 3, 4, 0, 2, 1, 6, 5, 3, 7. Now, by the key idea, we know that A plus A transpose is a symmetric matrix and A minus A transpose is a skew symmetric matrix. And we can write the matrix A as 1 by 2 into A plus A transpose plus 1 by 2 into A minus A transpose because this will be equal to A itself. So here 1 by 2 into A plus A transpose is a symmetric matrix and 1 by 2 into A minus A transpose is a skew symmetric matrix. Thus we can express A as a sum of symmetric and skew symmetric matrix. So that means here we need to find two matrices that is the matrix P which is equal to 1 by 2 into A plus A transpose and matrix Q, which is given by 1 by 2 into A minus A transpose. So first of all, let us find out A plus A transpose, which will be equal to the matrix A, that is the matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 3, 2, 5, 4, 1, 3, 0, 6, 7 plus the matrix A transpose with elements 3, 4, 0, 2, 1, 6, 5, 3, 7. Now we know that to add two matrices we add their corresponding elements. 
So this will be equal to the matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 3 plus 3 that is 6, 2 plus 4 that is 6, 5 plus 0 that is 5, 4 plus 2 6, 1 plus 1 2, 3 plus 6 9, 0 plus 5 5, 6 plus 3 9 and lastly 7 plus 7 that is 14. Now, the matrix P is given by 1 by 2 into A plus A transpose. So, the matrix P will be equal to 1 by 2 into the matrix A plus A transpose. That is, the matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 6, 6, 5, 6, 2, 9, 5, 9, 14. And to multiply a matrix with a scalar, we multiply each element of that matrix by the scalar, that is 1 by 2. So here, we will get the matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 3, 3, 5 by 2, 3, 1, 9 by 2, 5 by 2, 9 by 2, and 7. Now, let us check whether the matrix P is symmetric or not. So, let us find out P transpose, which will be a matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 3, 3, 5 by 2, 3, 1, 9 by 2, 5 by 2, 9 by 2, 7, which is equal to the matrix P itself. Thus, here the matrix P is a symmetric matrix. Now, let us find out the matrix A minus A transpose. So here, this will be equal to the matrix A, that is, the matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 3, 2, 5, 4, 1, 3, 0, 6, 7, minus A transpose, that is the matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 3, 4, 0, 2, 1, 6, 5, 3, 7. Now here, we will subtract each element of matrix A transpose from the corresponding elements of matrix A and thus this will be equal to the matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 3 minus 3 that is 0, 2 minus 4 minus 2, 5 minus 0, 5, 4 minus 2, 2, 1 minus 1, 0, 3 minus 6 minus 3, 0 minus 5 minus 5, 6 minus 3, 3, and 7 minus 7, 0. Now, the matrix Q is given by 1 by 2 into A minus A transpose. So, let us find out the matrix Q, which is equal to 1 by 2 into the matrix a minus A transpose, which is this one. So, Q will be equal to 1 by 2 into the matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 0, minus 2, 5, 2, 0, minus 3, minus 5, 3, 0. And here also, we will multiply each element of this matrix by the scalar 1 by 2. So this will be equal to the matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 0, minus 1, 5 by 2, 1, 0, minus 3 by 2, minus 5 by 2, 3 by 2, 0. Now, let us check whether Q is a skew symmetric matrix or not. 
So let us find Q transpose, which will be given by the matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 0, 1, minus 5 by 2, minus 1, 0, 3 by 2, 5 by 2, minus 3 by 2, 0, which is equal to minus Q. Thus, Q is a skew symmetric matrix. Now, let us find the matrix given by P plus Q. So, this will be the matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 3, 3, 5 by 2, 3, 1, 9 by 2, 5 by 2, 9 by 2 and 7 plus the matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 0, minus 1, 5 by 2, 1, 0, minus 3 by 2, minus 5 by 2, 3 by 2 and 0. And this will be equal to the matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 3 plus 0, 3, 3 plus minus 1, 2, 5 by 2 plus 5 by 2, that is 5, 3 plus 1, 4, 1 plus 0, 1, 9 by 2 plus minus 3 by 2, that is 3, 5 by 2 plus minus 5 by 2, 0, 9 by 2 plus 3 by 2, that is 6, 7 plus 0, 7, which is equal to the matrix A. Thus, the matrix A can be expressed as the matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 3, 3, 5 by 2, 3, 1, 9 by 2, 5 by 2, 9 by 2, 7, plus the matrix of order 3 by 3 with elements 0, minus 1, 5 by 2, 1, 0, minus 3 by 2, minus 5 by 2, 3 by 2, 0. Where this is a symmetric matrix and this is a skew symmetric matrix. Thus, we have expressed A as the sum of a symmetric and a skew symmetric matrix. With this, we finish this question and the session as well. Hope you must have understood the question. Goodbye, take care and have a nice day.